Hurricane Laura hit the Gulf Coast Thursday with wind speeds of 150 miles per hour. As people in Louisiana and Texas deal with the damage, Minnesotans have come to help. It's quite a, an event getting down here. Gregory Gray and his wife Renee are volunteers with the American Red Cross. They're scheduled to help in Louisiana for the next two weeks. And I spent uh, most of my adult life working in state government and uh, I did that largely because I, I cared about the community and I think this is kind of an offshoot of that. As of Sunday, more than 320,000 people in Louisiana were still without power and it could take weeks to restore. This will be definitely a significant uh, rebuild effort to get the lights back on. Kelly Block with Excel Energy says they've sent nearly 250 employees and contractors to help in the area's hardest hit. She expects they'll be gone for up to two weeks. They'll be working 16 hour days responding, you know, rebuilding lines. That's their day in, day out job, right? President Trump saw the damage firsthand on Saturday. Already met some people that have been absolutely devastated. This was a tremendously powerful storm. A powerful storm with a powerful response. Well, certainly the, the people in Minnesota ought to be proud of the fact that there's a significant contingent of volunteers uh, who regularly uh, come and help on these types of efforts. Heidi Wigdahl, Care 11 News.